It's Tuesday, July 30th, 2019, the eve of the new moon in Leo. Hello everyone, I am back up and running. We are in the balsamic moon phase. This is the time when we want to release what we do not want to carry into the next cycle. We prepare for the next month by clearing our mindsets of negativity. The moon is in Cancer today. It's 11 road in the Solkin. This is about finding a new way or the rebirth of a journey. Skill today is to exhale. True alignments or the higher octaves are breaking down complex things into manageable parts, fluid plans and efforts, truth under a superficial layer, allowing time to develop, understanding something that has been right in front of us, a moment frozen in time, and pleasurable expectations. Catalysts for change or the lower octaves are bragging, chronic problem finding, Absolute power corrupts absolutely. Celebrity culture. Unenthusiastic. Dressing something up to make it look more than it really is. Trying too hard to prove oneself. Undone. A missed opportunity. And things or people reaching a limit. To review the Sabian symbol for the Solar Lunar Month has been a clown caricaturing well-known personalities. This was the exaggeration of things in order to see truth or reality. And the Sabian symbol for the Solar Lunar Year, fairies dancing in the setting sun, sunset on the control systems. Today is a wonderful day to make an impression. We just want to be mindful of looking twice since Mercury is retrograde for a couple more days, giving us the tendency to rush to judgment and miss the deeper level or consequence of things. Mercury has been working hard since July 7th, 7-7, to throw us off of our old foundations and situations in order to jump to new ones. Mercury stationed retrograde at the Sabian symbol energetic of rock formations tower over a deep canyon. Since that time, it has been changing or even removing the ground beneath us. This continues until tomorrow night, just before midnight Eastern Time. At that time, we will need to begin making some choices. Mercury will station direct at 24 degrees of Cancer, a woman and two men castaways on a small island in the South Seas. So, archetypally and metaphorically, we move from a deep canyon to a tropical island. What do you think about that? What does this mean to you, specifically related to what has transpired this month? What has changed? How have you changed? What has been revealed to you this month? What got to extremes in order to be seen? What got to extremes in order to be released? This is the important message for today and for today and all that truly matters on the individual scale and the collective scale. It is worth some time for consideration because the new moon in Leo starts tomorrow, minutes before Mercury stations direct. Reflection is a very balsamic moon phase thing to do. Balsamic energy is best utilized by holding on loosely and stepping back a bit. It's about detaching to some degree from the past month so the new one can slide in. The new month actually is being blown in by air, wind, and spirit. The Sabian symbol for the incoming cycle is glass blowers shape beautiful vases with their controlled breathing. Doesn't that bring a sigh of relief? <laughs> this last month hit hard, as all the cardinal cycles, Aries, Cancer, Libra, and Capricorn always do here at the end of the Kali Yuga. The sun comes with the Leo cycle and clears things up, as clear as glass. Exhale today. Tomorrow, the breath of spirit arrives to fill the space. It is going to be a beautiful creation.